All right, neutral start. Oh, and already Chu just going on the offensive. But look at that. Look at that's what you got to do. That was beautiful by Smash God getting the double fair to down air. Getting rid of Nana just right off the bat. Whew. That was great. But dangerous here. Did not get the jump back. It's going to kill him. Smash God has taken a few early percent deaths from the down smashes. So, got to be careful. Here you go. Sopo in it. Ooh, the side B. He almost got it with the back air. Ooh, that air dodge so low to stage. And look at that sweet spot double jump getting around the down tilt. He's chewing no. The chew truly knows. You got to get around that or else you're just going to die. Oh, but he got the tech of place with the tipper. Bam. Nice. Once again, not electing to continue. Here we go. Oh, and look at the fade, too, to get the edge cancel, just for the extra safety. Brilliant stuff by Smash God. Tournament winner actually not too bad for Smash God. He had all three. He had his jump, he had his side B, he had his up B. A nice approaching F tilt. You know, when you're in the corner like that, you might as well try and force him away. There it is. You got the split. Nice target switch. Immediately just turning around and going for Popo. Gets the tipper again. Smash got two for two on the big tips. We got ourselves a tie game. There's the taunt by Nana. And there's an SD. Goodbye. Oh, and Chu accidentally missing the wave dash out of the blizzard. That could have been a wobble. But that is a real new lease on life for Smash God. Oh, and wow, the hit extension hit Nana, and so the hitbox stayed out longer, and he got tipped by it. That was crazy. Oh, jab. Oh, wow, the STI up and out. But he gets wobbled again. Chu taking game one. He got out of that jab, though, so fast. He just, like, flew up. But Chu's still getting the wobble. All right. So Smash God logs the result of every single game he plays. Every single tournament. He puts the stage, he puts the characters, he puts the stock count. Um, so I love that. I think that's so cool to see how you do against certain players or certain matchups on certain stages, right? So he like tells me like, you know, when I play LOD, I have a much better success rate on Fountain than I do on, on, on Stadium actually, which is crazy. But it's just that information that helps you make more educated counterpick decisions. Well, that, that Nair is super dangerous. They're pretty lucky it split. Oh, my God. And there's a tipper on Nameless here. Oh, wow. That was not the greatest upbeat. Is he going to get there? Nope. Great DI out by Chu. Man, it is just amazing. Even with the slope down on Yoshi's, he still just goes right around the down tilt. Randall in the building. Oh, all right. So po. Oh, the patience, my Smash God. There it is. Utilizing that ledge uh, to get down there and, and get the tipper. A lot of things would have killed, but that will definitely kill at 128. Ooh, look at him just the movement around the platform, trying to bait out moves by Chudat. Oh. Oh, wow. And so that is next level brilliance. Instead of going for the tip or F smash, he goes for the fair knowing that Nana automatically is going to be DIing in and gets the down air. That was so smart by Smash God. All right. Oh, and the no impact landing. So smart. Immediately being able to react or uh, act out of that. Oh, slippery. Look at he just he just even with all the jumping around on the platforms, he doesn't throw out a single move unless he like he knows it's gonna hit. Like he's done, I think the, for the first six or seven moves in that stock, all of them connected. That is gonna kill double up air 113. Wow. Look at that, the dash dance of the patience. He's gonna kill Nana. Yes he is. Ooh. 
Oh, Sharkin, man. And, man, like, True Dance Recovery has been exceptionally good this set. Wow, I can't believe they didn't tip her. But he's been able to get around all of the, the options that Smash Guy's been putting out, whether it's the down tilts, the rising down airs. You know, even right there, he got around the fair. He took an F-Smash, but he got his jump back. All right, Smash God with a small lead. Wow, wow, you like went up on those? And bounce off the platform? All right. Quick reaction by Smash God 2 to just bounce off and reset. That was smart. All right, you just trying to make it happen. Oh, and he grabbed, uh, I guess in that situation, either one, he grabbed... He's going to be able to let it down smash rip, even as the non-controllable climber. Oh, all right. And it's still in play. Oh, not for long. Yes. Oh, and he got there just in time to get the ledge. That was huge, because now Wobble off the table. Oh. So, we've seen comebacks. Jab, grab. Oh, no punish, though. Yep. See you later. Alligator. Beautiful stuff by Smash God. It's basically taking him for a ride. Great Ken combo. So, basically, really quickly. Let me speed up just a little bit. Oh, never mind. We'll talk, we'll talk later. We'll talk later. That was really nice by Smash God. Basically. All right. The neutral start again. <coughs> No surprise going to FD. Is this interesting that Chu just goes for uh, up throw, or not up throw, he goes for the up smash, and then he follows it up with an aerial from Popo? So I feel like if you if you have it going, you could try for a wobble. Another early percent death for Smash God, though. He's been caught with the poor DI and the down smashes multiple times. Again, even there, he like flew for only having 20%. He's gotta be careful. Uh oh. Oh, he tried to get the, the Nana. Didn't get the tech. Oh, and the spot dodge getting caught by the double nair. Ooh, I love, man. Smash Cut's dash dance is so pretty. Oh, and that, that could get DI'd out of. You can DI that down and away and, and get out. Shoot out, just getting caught. All right. And is Dana going to get there in time? Yes, but great DI by Smash God. He's going to live. But F Smash at 120. Bearing through and okay. All right. Uh, that was pretty sick. <laughs> All right. Ooh. Slight, slip, slight separation. Gets the F Smash on, uh, on Nana, but Popo not high enough percent. You're not going to. Oh, great fair. Nana getting stuck and tumbled. No saving her. She don't want to be saved. So, that was big. Oh, wow. I can't believe that didn't hit. Looks like it was going to be right at the end. All right. Not going to kill quite yet. Oh, it's going to knock him up. I thought he was going to try and up tilt. There it is. Not going to kill, but he does connect. Gets an edge guard situation. He's going to have to squall. And again, he'll do it again. But this time he doesn't have to. And that's it. Ooh, down tilting him away. Is Nana going to get there in time? Nope. Great mash by Smash God. Not giving up any hope. Great side B usage to get him off the ledge. Able to come back. And that wave dash forward, F tilt, getting Chu a lot of mileage. Again, we saw that in the first set where he air dodged and accidentally fast falls to his death. Ooh, that knockdown getting the tip on Nana. Nana not going to come back. All right, Smash God, you got to get the stock. You have this opportunity to play Martha versus Sopo on, on FD. You get a ton of percent as he's doing so right now. Ooh, good down smash, knowing that 
Smash Gun was going to run behind him, but still, a lot of percent. If he can hold on to 30% going in the final stock, it's not over. Got him off stage. Wow! Got the up smash. He was even starting to Squall Hammer, but got the tipper forward smash. That was a brilliant stock by Smash God. All right, got to get rid of Nana. Oh, well, those are so dangerous. You know, I like the spaced out down tilts, the tipper down tilts, but he was getting real close again. Here we go. Is that it for Nana? No, Nana barely getting the ledge. Still alive. And there it is. That's how you get out. That's not a thing. He's going to take Nana all the way. No. Nope. Oh, that dash attack on shield. Good back to shield by Chew Dat. Wow. Oh, the knockdown with the double F tilt, but able to get to ledge. Woo. Oh, good down tilt. Poking her away. Well, that's going to do it for Nana. Oh, but you got to watch out. Yep, one down smash and you're going to die. Uh, that corner positioning. Smash Guy trying to bring this back. Ooh, the pivot fair. And that is it. Smash Guy with the beautiful last two stocks to bring it back and take game three on FD. That was immaculate. She's not getting touched. That was, whew, that was beautiful. All right, so Smash got up 2-1 here. So now even if Chu does get this game here on FD, he's got a counter pick still in the back pocket. That was ridiculous. All right, another neutral start, 755. Oh, good patience by Chu waiting out the fair. Getting another double down smash. All right. Got a split. Who well, actually jumps over Nana, but I don't like that. Still gets to grab on Popo. <laughs> Ugh. Man, just, every time Chu throws out some ill advised whatever, whether it's a down smash or Smash Guy's just dash dancing has been so good. Look at him dash dancing under the double uh, ice block shot. Still getting a punish. Oh, that's actually. Oh, wow. That was a. Super low backer by Chu. That was brilliant. Just pop him off the ledge. Oh, and the tomahawk is so good. You know, Chu is sitting in shield right there, expecting the fair. Uh, and instead, Smash got taking his time, you know, getting the grab, and that's going to do it for Nana. Woo! Look at that, just forcing. You got him to throw. Oh my god. Jesus. Chu, honestly, Chu playing kind of shaky, playing antsy. Just gotta relax. Smash God's the one just baiting out all the mistakes. Oh, not the greatest DI again. And that time he goes the up and out on the air dodge. But this should still be. Oh, didn't do the neutral get him, he did a roll get up. I say he should have led into a grab, but Smash God will take that. Still living. It's good fair to create some space. Oh, and I thought he was gonna maybe go for the shield grab off the jab, but Chu closing up that stock. <coughs> oh, good little link together with the Soko there. Oh, so dash attack is super high risk high reward in this matchup. You can get a tipper dash attack on a Sopo or on either climber, it pops them up perfectly. However, it's really laggy and if you do it on shield, it's gonna get shield grabbed. So really high risk high reward there. Worked out for Smash God. He, he got popped up. He was able to get some percent. <coughs> and again, he's sharking around that jab attempt. Oh, and I don't know if he had to do that air dodge. A great DI going up. He's gonna survive the first one, but getting caught with the tipper up air. He's gonna do it for that. Wow, it looked like Smash Guy was trying to, you know, DI that jab down the ledge, but Chudi had saying, no sir, it grabbed him. Got Nana there in time. Ooh, Nana, a little taunt, no big deal. 
We got a split, but Chu sneaking under. Oh, here you go. Got another split. Ooh, no jump for the Poe. No jump for the Poe. Throw, throw, pivot. Oh, he does the dash attack instead, which isn't that bad. Oh, that phantom up there. Are you kidding me? We try to do the DI mix up. Try to catch him DIing down and away for the for the down throw, but instead he was actually correctly DI the forward throw. That was great stuff by Chu. Oh, greedy. This is the first time in a minute we've seen Smash God throw out that super laggy F smash instead of just waiting for Chu to do something. Nice, he's gonna have to squall. Up tilt, yep. All right, once again, we saw the same situation. Smash God brought it all the way back on last stock here. He's just got to get rid of Nana. All right, picking up valuable percent on the NPC. Gets out in time. Oh, but he gets caught by the down air re-grab, and we're going to game five. Oof. Once again, that is not guaranteed. But sometimes when you're just thinking about mashing out, you're trying to get out, you're not thinking about DI. You're just trying to, you know, pray that you that you get out in time, especially that high percent. So good awareness by Chu to, to throw that out. So they're going to FOD, which Smash God won game one here in the winner set. Once again, I think this stage is pretty good for Mario. I like Chu staying right under the platforms, trying to get some double up airs. So even if they don't connect, you can still get some good valuable shield damage. Oh, the jab grab, but he gets out so quick. Jeez. Oh, but yep. I've smashed on shield. Ice Thomas can get that wave dash out of shield. He's like Luigi and Ice Climber, so like the two characters are if you Tipper F smash shield, they could still wave dash out and punish. I think. I know Luigi for sure. I mean, Luigi has the longest wave dash and nice guy was at the second, so it would make sense. Oh, whoops. I don't want to see that happen. Nice pivot tipper on Nana. You take 20% for it, or 37% for it, but you get rid of Nana. Ooh, look at that, just beautiful pivot fair. Again, getting a lot of mileage out of that. It pops him up perfectly for the Ken combo. I like this. We've seen a lot of Smash God doing, he'll get one fair into a second fair, and then he'll immediately fade back out. He'll get the approximately like 18%, maybe a little bit more, 20 something percent on Nana, and then just immediately get out. And if you just keep adding those up, then eventually it's gonna be at the point where when you tip or fair Nana, She's too high up for like Chewed out to sneak under and get the the, uh, the down smash that we've seen him do a few times. Oh, wow. What a smart play by Smash God. Getting launched and still back airing Nana. Oh, wow. Just cuts. Again, the Noah back land is so good. Is so good. It's the mix up. Oh my god. Pivot tips. Got those. We're knocked him back down. Oh, that back air did connect. So he's gonna have to up B. A good timing on the roll up. And he's once again exactly tied. Two stocks apiece. Woo! Caught the jump. Oh, you can't be seeing that smash on shield. Wow, he got that fair out so quick. And that's it for Nana. Smash God has just done an exceptional job of doing the right target. Whether you target Popo or Nana, he's been doing a great job of getting tons of percent on both of them, regardless of which one he's going for at the certain moment. He's also done a pretty good job of mixing it up, looking like he's gonna go for one, and actually turns the Jets and goes for the other. But Chu trying to bring back some percent with the Sopo. The down, yeah, I was going to say, using that jump, so dangerous. And Chu Dap potentially on his last stock of the tournament. Smash got one stock away from winning this thing through winners. 
you that. Looking for an opening. There it is. That's it. The man killing at 80%. Nana's still in the game. He's gonna have to use his invincibility smart here. There it is. Ooh, just the most basic. Is he gonna get? Nope. The most basic tech. If you can get your short hop double fares down. Oh, all right. Good backer by Chu to push him off. Still is nothing. Tons of percent. Oh, he barely gets out. Oh, that is it. That's it. We got ourselves a reset. Chu that clutching it out. Woof. Man. Double back air getting the job done. Wowie. All right. So here we go. We're going to go back to Battlefield. I think Chu knows now to strike um, FOD and Yoshi's. So we'll see. And my guess is they're going to go to Battlefield, uh, especially because Chu won game one on Battlefield in, in the first set of grants. So, yep, going right back. Jeez, what a close set for the first one. We got ourselves one more. Press one for Chudat, press two for Smash God. This, Jesus. Vince is clutching his heart. Oh, I don't know if I can do this. Oh man, just, wow. Smash God putting all the cuts in all the right places. Ooh. Still just cannot touch him. The zero to death on the first stock for Smash God. Finally, first hit. We had a good split there. Yeah, Nana on the top platform, but not the top platform, she's side platform. Able to get back to her man. Oh, look how fast the mash is. So critical. So I would love to, you know, if there's a situation where he's sitting in shield and, and Smash God does a pretty good job of recognizing when he's just doing that. Oh my God, Smash God playing out of his mind right now. But put a shield breaker on, right? You're gonna get contact. Uh, with both shields. It's going to do you a lot of good. But Smash God out to a gigantic lead. Oh, and he waited a little too long. Got down smashed. He's going to be able to come back. And no real punish. And not the greatest DI again. Maybe trying to dash away and he's actually going to do it. Smash God taking a second. First two stocks were absolutely gorgeous. Too dangerous again. Using those double jumps. Oh, the Nair out of shield to push off. Oh my god, another one. And this game is all of a sudden tied. Oh, wow, Chu just totally turned the tides on this game. Granted, Smash got helped him out a little bit, but still. She was just tacked on at 100% here. If you get the reverse there on Nana, but great save by Chu. Oh, great F till. Oh, but Nana saying not today. We missed the pivot. There you go, Nana. Get gone. Done for. All right. Not quite. Oh, wow. Ooh. Going in with the raw grab. Well, he tried to read the tech away. Didn't quite get it. And the side be up till getting the job done. Smash got. Oh, again. In this situation, Nana was just that time actually on the top platform. No real punish. But Smash got. Trying to tack on a lot of percent here. Whoa, we. It's okay. Yep. Still is a side B. Oh, but a little bit too. So he did the first side B, which is great because it pushed Chu on the ledge. The second side B, he did not. Like, he went too close on the stage and died for it. Oh, the get up attack by Nana pushing into the down smash? Jeez, close. Oh, great spacing. The fade back on the fair by Smash God. The Nair out of shield was coming, and that was, cannot believe you did not get punished for that forward smash on the shield. Oh, here we go, edge guard. Oh, that Nair, dangerous. 
Oh, he gets the tipper. That's it. Smash God with the... Both of these guys have been putting together insanely clutch performances, game in and game out. Smash God getting the better there. Uh, getting the tipper for game one. Jeez. All right, yep, immediately going to FD. But Smash God proving this isn't an auto win. He got game two, excuse me, game three for the first set. Just gotta play smart. Here you go, he played smart, got an opening. Got the jump for mana, that's how you do it, baby. That's all you gotta do. Ooh, nice, getting around the back air. Oh, and look at that. Ooh. Trying to find some way to kill him. And there you go. And he could just get up and up tilt. But again, does he get the right hitbox? That's the skull hammer again, though. Oh, he tried to do the mix up. Once again, you can mash B to go higher, or you can just press it and, and drop. Try to mix Smash got up, but a little bit too quickly and too low. Ooh, Tomahawk. Getting the grab on Nana. Oh, the jab coming up to the downer? All right, yeah, that down tilt way too close. <laughs> and he just got shield grab for it. Oh, is that it for Nana? Yes, it is. Oh, and, and he took no percent for it either. Oh, and I love that fade back Nair to cover. Uh, Air dodge in. Even if he gotten around him, he still would have gotten clipped by the back hit box. But unfortunately, did not get to grab ledge at all. And in fact, SD. Oh my God! Smash God! Jesus! Okay. Okay. Smash God! Holy moly! Is this man about to three stock chew on FD? He's playing out of his mind right now. Ooh. He just said, I dare you. Look at that, he nared right in front of him. Every other shield grab, every other ice gun were to shield grab the situation. Maybe choose should. So every hit, every hit counts. 26, 34, 50. Well, I finally might do it. I think he used the double jump to get back up. So I think he can, yep. Hearth killer, down smash. But now he's got a still, still has a full fresh stock. Plus another one in the bank. All he really has to do is get rid of Nana. But Chu doing his darndest. Chu doing his damn darndest trying to bring this back. Gets the wobble and all of a sudden that 3-1 lead is down to 1-1. So I think instead of just going for these Randy F smashes off the Angel platform, yeah, he needs to do a little bit more of what he's been doing. Pivot, you know, you your aerials. Dash dancing, trying to bait. Uh, that's what you gotta do. Edge guard situation here. This is the down air. Ooh, gets around the dash deck. All right. Up tilt. Yep. And that is it. Smash God getting game two on FD up 2-0. So they'll probably go back to FD for game three, but then he has two shots on Yoshi's. This is going extraordinarily well for Smash God trying to get this win. Uh, Got to dig deep. I mean, Smash God was honestly just like outplaying the crap out of him that game. He had such good mix-ups uh, when she was sitting on shield between Tomahawk grabbing and popping up with aerials. There's got to be an adjustment here. Already? 30%? Plus, a, yeah, I was going to say, decent amount of percent on Nana. Oh, but wow, the get-up attack putting Smash got directly into Popo's arms. What a pass. That was beautiful. Oh, no jump. Good double side B again to force him on the ledge and then force him off. Okay. Here you go, got a split. Oh, but that time he hesitated. He, like, did that back air, but he was a little bit too far away to actually finish it on Nana. So that that's a stock. <coughs> Excuse me. That brief moment of hesitation, that was the big difference. 
And again, good standing fair to cover the approach option by Chu. Uh, Chu's approach, excuse me. Oh, and that's not going to kill. Huge stage. Yep, floating now, very jelly. She's all right. Oh, and even that Nair is still not going to kill. Jeez, Nana just getting bounced. But it doesn't matter. Oh, that's not real. That's not real. Oh, it can't. Man, we see Chu drop a few wobbles today. Oh, wow. That was so close. Just rolled right around the da down smash range. And, yeah, he tried to, to space. He did correctly read the tech in, but he was a little bit too far. All right, Jabs. I see you. Yep, good patience by Smash God. I mean, he had to do something. He, he was too far away to just grab ledge, so he had to either air dodge, squall hammer, or a B. And the patience by Smash God. Really shown. Oh, I was going to say, so, you know, like, almost exclusively Chu's been doing the uh, up smash into fair. Just pick up some percent of those early grab out attempts. Doing a lot better for Chu here in game three. Oh, slowly walking. Oh, look at this. So he does the down tilts because once again, you can react out or you can act out of those quickest. So he knows that if Chu gets in that space, he can just immediately turn around and, and either aerial or put a forward smash out. Oh, wow. You almost got there and stuck in and took the ledge. That was close. He has the jump. Oh, and wow, the double spot dodge avoiding the back air down smash, but he does get hit with another back air. And uh, like I said, looking a lot better for Chu here. Down smash on shield, definitely not safe. So, uh, maybe if you're Smash God, you know, you, you do what you can here, but ultimately, you're happy. You're up 2 0. You got a game on Chu's indisputably best counter pick, and you get to take him to Yoshi's now at least. You know, or at most two games in a row. You get you get two shots. But if if their past sets have been any indicator, Smash got two and zero in the Yoshi's games. So let's we'll see if he can just wrap it up. With a slow dancing blade, taking the sweet time to extend those hitboxes. <coughs> All right, that's uh, not going to do it. Great DI. And there it is. Got them both. All right, Nana, taunting. No regard for human life. Ooh, jumping out and away. Nicely done by Smash God out of the blizzard. Well, here we go. Wait a second. Oh, yeah, that down on shield. Nope. All right, but once again, it's it's okay. If you're a Smash God, it's okay. You're up 2-1. You did what you were supposed to do in one game one, and then you still beat them on on uh, on FD. So now Dreamland out of the question. You just get to do Yoshi's and look at that. I think Chu actually picked Yoshi's four. He's like, I know where you're going. We're gonna go to Yoshi's. So we'll see if Smash God can close it out here, or if Chu can force a game five. Already, choose back Smash got into a corner. But Smash got not scared. Oh, woo! Yeah. Well, the air dodge in was so important. Avoided the F smash and the mash out too. Both of these guys just like the defensive options have been really good. Ooh, look at these little little wave lands off. She was some slick movement. I see you. Wow, that reach was crazy. Did he get the jump? No, he did not. But that is going to kill. Good good timing on that, too, to get the top. Uh, more vertical knockback, the more you are closer to the back of the up B. So right around the top is a good spot. It's going to kill at one, what was it, like 113? Ooh. Cuts. Cuts. 
Slice. That's it for Nana. And again, he's got a full stock. No Nana. He's got to come back from this, though. These early percent deaths against Sopo. Great reaction by Chu. But he's coming back. Ooh. Chu trying to close the stock out. Just can't quite do it. Oh, the back air. I feel like if he down there, there, he might have hit him, actually. I think the first time Chu just, like, straight up jumped around an aerial. Woo! Okay. Look at that is actually the fastest snow impact land I've ever seen. He like immediately knew how to do it. Again! Just perfect. No impact lands. He got the up tilt, the first one. There it is. Finally getting the uh the down air, seeing that you went a little bit too low, had to double jump. And Smash God. Big lead. Oh my god, these pivot fairs spacing right around that F smash. And that not quite gonna do it, but he still picked up 50% on, on Popo. Oh, I was gonna say he could have just grabbed ledge. He's gonna live. Great DI in the back air. Oh, Nana kept him in the game. That is huge. That should have been a stock, but Nana saying not today. And if he can get any more percent off this, that would be huge. And he knows Randall's coming. Yep, there it is. Already 6% more than it had to be. All right, F tilt finally get a kill at 175, but Smash God dominant here in Game Four or the early goings. We got a split. Ooh, and even when he's working with the split, gets a ton of percent on Sopo. Jeez. Oh, there it is again. There it is. It's so good. You just pretty lazily, honestly, falling to top platform. And Smash got immediately getting the up the uh, up tilt out. And right now, Chu needs to really bring this back. But look at this, he can't get in against the down tilts. Is that a wobble? No, it's not. Ooh. All right. Still dancing on him, and now 47%. And that's also, who knows what Nana. I feel like Nana's got more than that. He's got a 3-1 lead. Smash got on the brink of winning the Xanadu. That's it for Nana. He's going to have to do this all the way with Sopo, which... Really, 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 really unlikely. But we'll see. Yep. God damn. Put him in the dumpster. Smash God getting the 3 1. 3 1, 2 3, 3 1 for the victory here at Xanadu 189. What a performance by him. And let's go, MD. Maryland.